Um, National Marine Life Center was founded in 1995 because of the huge numbers of animals that we have stranded in and around Cape Cod. By now, you all know this, but I just wanted to let you know the numbers. And in any given year, there can be almost 300 turtles that strand. There could be 56 live seals that strand and almost 100 dolphins that strand in any one year. And that's just this little region. So about 10, 15 years ago, a group of people got together and said, we need to build a hospital to help these animals. And not only to help the animals, but then to use the animals to learn more about the environment, because they're telling a lot of us telling us what's going on in the ocean about ocean health and then to take what they teach us and teach others through ed educational programs. And these aren't <coughs> uh, ubiquitous species, these are endangered species, these are some of them. Are, all of the are species rare. are, all of the marine mammals are federally protected under the Marine Mammal Protection Act. All of the sea turtles are on the endangered species list. They're all either threatened or endangered. And we're talking about rare endangered species that Precisely. everyone is valuable, really needs to, to keep the species alive. Exactly. It was nice a few years back to get that tank. You started treating animals. And so what that's, you, that's what we've been doing for the last four or five years. And we've, even though we've been in a borrowed building with less than ideal circumstances, we felt it important to um, begin our mission. We started caring for our first sea turtle in 2004. And then um, I came in 2005, we started caring for our first Kemp's release, which as you heard from Don, is the most endangered sea turtle in the world. 2006 brought our first red-bellied cooters, it's a head start turtle. 2007, our first seal, and 2008, our first diamondback terrapin. So mm -hmm. we're just gradually building as we go forward. Um, we started our formal science program in 2007. We started education programs for the last four years, and we're reaching more kids every single year.